Hi, my name is Dave Andrews. Today I'm going to show you how to check and repair a system files in Microsoft Windows Vista. Let's go to our desktop and we're going to run a, a command that comes with Windows Vista. Uh, if you click on your start button and in the little search uh, area right here, we're just going to type CMD as in command and for the command prompt, right click on it and say run as administrator because you have to execute this program we're going to execute as an administrator. Um, just click continue on the security window that pops up. Now what we're going to do is run a system file checker. What that's going to do is that's going to scan through um, all of the Windows Vista system files and it's going to make sure that none of them have become corrupted or have been uh, somehow replaced with a malicious file that could be causing us problems. So, and it will, also rest, it will also restore those files. So we want to run the system file checker and the command is SFC for system file checker followed by space and the forward leaning slash scan now. Uh, all one word. So it's SFC space slash scan now. Just press enter. And as you can see, our system file checker is beginning its scan. It's going to take a little bit of time. And uh, it's going to scan through all of uh, Windows Vista system files, make sure they're intact, and make sure that they're valid. My name's Dave Andrews, and I've just showed you how to check and repair system files on Windows Vista.